Hello Facebook, my name is Medea. I am the founder of Slay Ambassador Magazine. We are with the lovely Deidre Johnson Dixon. Hi you guys! She is the founder of the No Fear Ever Movement. She is the identity coach, an entrepreneur, a fearless strategist, and a motivational speaker. Absolutely. So we're gonna, first we want to thank her for being one of Slay Ambassador Magazine's first sponsors. We are so happy to have her. Thank you, yes. I'm glad to be here. So we're gonna get this interview going. Um, so Deidre. Yes. Tell us about the No Fear Ever campaign. Fear came out of my mouth and I was like, where did that come from? And I just kept saying it. And by the time we ended that first session, we were all saying no fear, just encouraging each other. Be fearless, right? No fear, don't allow fear to stop you. Just encouraging each other. And so I started using that as a hashtag every time I posted something on social media. And now it has turned into a movement and I'm just so excited about what God is doing with it. Yeah. Awesome. Awesome. I think a lot of times people hear no fear or associate me with no fear and think that I have it all together. I've had some people tell me that and I'm thinking, girl, I just had a crying session with Jesus yesterday because I want to stop, right? So I don't have it all together. The whole point of no fear is so that I believe that I can be challenged so that I can challenge other people. You can't really be uh, effective in your with your message if there's no conviction, no passion behind it. And so the whole No Fear Ever campaign is to remind me daily, stop being afraid, go for it. You can do this, you got this. Yeah, I love it, yeah. I love it. So Deidre, tell us about the No Fear um, and you know, how has this brand message, this lifestyle, this affirmation taken you to the next level in your life? <laughs> it challenges me every day. I asked God, why did you give me this, this slogan? Honestly, like when I don't understand stuff, I pray. That's what I do. And I was asking God, why did you give me this brand? And he said, because you're scared of everything. You're scared to do anything I tell you. And he said, you gotta stop that. You know, it, it's okay to have that emotion, but it becomes unproductive when you stay stuck in that emotion. Well, some people would say that having no fear ever is impossible. Ha! How do you respond to that? Okay, <laughs> okay. So, people will take the no fear ever slogan and misconstrue with them it is impossible to not have fear but there is negative fear and positive fear fear that fuels you fear that pushes you fear that makes you say okay I'm scared but I'm I'm more scared if I'm in the same spot next year that I am today right so that's the kind of fear uh, that I'm saying to address address that negative fear and allow the positivity of fear to fuel you and push you further and so I just allow that negative fear to pass I talk to it you know I don't just try to ignore it I talk to it and I'll be like yeah I know you here <laughs> I know I'm afraid to do this but on the flip side of that I'm more afraid to be in the same spot next year that uh, where I am today that's good those are great points yeah yes. I hear that <laughs> y'all need to go follow Deidre Johnson Dixon right now because she has been my mentor in the past and I yes. guarantee you you will not be disappointed so how does it feel each time you conquer here oh, I feel what did Brandy say I'm on top of the world. Okay. Wasn't that a song back in the day? Yes. Living on top of the world, okay. right? Okay. That's how I feel every time I conquer something. Because for so long, I allowed the, the negative labels and opinions of others to be my reality. And so when I finally stopped that and began to believe in my potential and my ability, dude, it feels so good every, I know you're not a dude, but every time I accomplish something, it feels so good because for so many years, I didn't need other people talking me out of it. I talked myself out of a lot of opportunities that I had presented to me. I was like, no, 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 because I didn't really believe in myself. But now, please, 
you can't stop her. <laughs> well, the No Fear Movement has been such a contagious mindset on your social network. Yes, yes. How can we, Slay Ambassador Magazine, yes, help you spread this this movement wider? How can we put it out there so that people can just get on board with this No Fear Everything? Yes, well, I just came out with my first no Fear Ever product, okay. which are two t-shirts. Okay. Um, they're v-neck. One is bling. It's a white one. It's rose gold bling. And the other one is a unisex one. It's black and silver. And they say fearless. So it's the word fearless, but the message is saying to fear less. Right. Love it. And so um, I just came out with those. You can pre-order those. You can go to my page. I'll repost that after this interview. All of my handles are the same at Deidre Je uh, Johnson D. At Deidre Johnson D. Did I hear that? So follow, so follow her me today. You will see. Yes. Follow her right now. Deidre Johnson Dick <laughs> said. And we just want to say thank you for Playing Ambassador Magazine for allowing us to have this opportunity yes. to tap in on No Fear Ever. Yes. We love it. We support you. Thank and you. We rock with you. Thank you. Okay. Well, I want to say congratulations to Slay, Slay Ambassador Magazine. Um, when, when it launches officially, I just want to say congratulations. I know I will be there. And I am celebrating you as well. Yes. Facebook Live. This has been a pleasure of ours. Um, you can follow us at Peter Johnson Dixon. And you can follow Slay Ambassador Magazine. Um, Go online and look at our website, slayambassadormagazine.com. If you want uh, promotions and marketing and advertising, email us at slayambassadormag at gmail.com. And we are looking forward to hearing from you soon. Thank you.